Okay, here is uh, the deal. I went and recorded in the living room because the living room has wood and tile floors and a huge walls and ceiling. So I was hoping it would give like a natural reverb to what I was doing. And the strings on the guitar are really dirty old strings. And the action on my guitar is all sucked up. So it's going to have more of a like crunch to it, I guess. And because I was in that big room, I thought that the guitar would sound really big. And it sounds big, but not nearly as big as I thought it was going to sound. And so when I was singing, I was trying to sing louder with more, um, like, edge to it, like, um, like more, uh, because it's a dirty, ugly, horrific album. Like, the, the songs are very um, dark. And... I think the only thing that's wrong that I don't like is that the G string, no jokes, the G string is very bright. And um, so there's a couple songs where it's like, like very tinny and ting, 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 ting. And um, I kind of like it, but it's just, it's so different than most of the stuff I record, because most of the stuff I record, I try to, this might sound weird, but I try to make it blue. Like, I try to make the music come out as the color blue. And this album, I was trying to make the songs come out as the color red. I don't know if that makes any sense to you, um, or to anybody, but... In my head, that's how it makes sense to me. So I might just go ahead and leave it as is because it is so different. And um, I don't know. I'll send you some songs and you get, maybe you'll understand what I'm talking about. And like, I could probably tone some of that down. Like, if I put it in logic and like start fucking with it. <clears throat> but I honestly don't know if I want to because it like it takes like the whole thing was an experiment so if I start fucking with it then it's not really an experiment anymore it's me trying to fix things that might not sound and it's like me fixing imperfections and like I don't want to put makeup on this or I just want her to go out and get fucked if that makes sense okay so I've been like walking around and talking to you this whole time and I hadn't even fucking hit record not a good sign, but it is um, Sunday, October 24th, 21 at 10.02 a.m. And we're going to record Skin Slip right now. All right. Let's see. I'm going to record it on my phone because I think that sounds good although the mic on this sounds really good too so i don't know we will see let me make this bigger Oh, 
tricky moments in there but I wanted to record in here because it's got this big ass ceiling and I think it um, has a little more to it you know I don't know what the fuck to call it like reverb and warmth we'll say for the first song so one take one song that's, that's the way I like to do it <clears throat> so hopefully we could we could keep that going. Touch wood. All right, let's see what are we doing now? Are we doing drag? Yeah, I think we're doing drag. All right. <sighs> I wish like I could do more creative direction on this documenting the album. But I have the fucking lyrics. <laughs> <laughs> on um, my computer screen, so I, I fucking I don't, I'm, I don't really have a whole lot of options here, guys. Okay, so let's we'll we'll put this here. I'm gonna have a sip of coffee. Oh yeah. Okay, let's see. <laughs> bring it down do you want to see like what i'm playing i don't know if that's ever a thing but then like you can't see my face right i can't see the screen Hang on. yeah that's okay we'll do that all right just to mix it up a little bit okay so give me you're tired and weak okay wait is this still recording yeah okay whip 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 I have too many buttons to push. I'm jamming, I'm jamming, hey, help me please. I'm begging, I'm fading, get the release. I'm dying, I'm dying, I can't see. Screaming, 
I'm screaming, I can't breathe. Drag the river, drag the smell. I'm the missing person who's on the TV. Drag the river, drag the smell. I'm missing you cause I'm missing me And this place is cold, this place is haunting me I can hear you screaming, your boats I Drank the river, drank the smell Yeah, I kind of fucked up a few times, but I don't know. I kind of, I kind of liked it. I kind of liked it. I think I'm waking everybody up now. Probably should have played the quieter songs first. What's next? Oh, Mimes and Worms. That's a cool one because I could, I know that one really well. Am I going to do it in E? Did I decide that? The gizmo. <clears throat> uh, the gizmo. Yeah, I guess I am. Shit. I don't know. I think I was going to do it in F sharp. And guess what? I don't think I'm gonna. Okay. <clears throat> All right. Well, let's put a rubber on and get this lady to the hotel room. Am I right? All right. <laughs> that at all that's not the right words okay so we're gonna come back to that um i know that's how i wrote it but that's not how i ever sing it i got small and ham this guy's got me wait I, got... I don't think it's i got He's got mold in him. That guy's mold in him. Yeah, that's right. Okay, fuck, dude. <sighs> Basically, like I wrote that this song in um, on May twenty fifth, two thousand three, and over the years of playing this song, because this is a song that Creeperson did too. Um, the words <clears throat> changed because after I thought I knew the words, I would just sing whatever the fuck I wanted to sing. And so now, like, knowing how I've always sung it and then going back to the words that I actually originally written, they're a little bit different. And so I'm like, <gasps> I'm like what just happened? All right, let's see here. So this is Mimes and Worms. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Same way out 
just mimes out just the same With worms round thin in our skin And hideous maggots deep within Corpses will affirm the hero of our plays, the conquering world. Conquering world. Get your casket and go. Get your casket and go. Each man he will have a grave made of earth and worm. Cause we're just mams, so it seems. We're just mams, we seem to be. We're just mams, all the same. We're all just mams, all just the same. With bumps writhing in our skin And hideous maggots deep within Now corpses will affirm The hero of our play is the conquering worm The hero of our play is the conquering worm The hero of our play is the conquering worm And the hero of my play the conquering world Conquering world Conquering world That was, that was weird. I don't know how I liked that. I'll listen to it and see if I like it. I did miss a note at the end of the song there. But I'm trying to make it sound different enough from the other recordings of that. That um, it's worth listening to, I guess. I don't know if that makes any sense. I just hate making songs sound exactly the same every time I do them. So, and I've, I've recorded that song a couple different times, a couple different ways. So, that one I tried to play the guitar softer, but tried to make my voice harsher the whole time. Because typically, I do soft voice, soft verse... And then, um, as the song goes, my voice gets harsher on the choruses to match the strumming. But, um, I've done that like on three different versions of that song. So I don't know. I don't know if that worked or made sense, but we'll fucking see. Now this song is kind of tricky. And now I'm going to tell you guys something that I probably haven't told you yet. This guitar is fucked. So, let's see. I don't know if you're going to be able to see. Well, first off, my um, this is loose and I can't get in there to fix it. My guitar is dusty as shit. Okay, but seriously, if you can see the action on this thing... It is super high. And some of you who like actually know guitars are like, how the fuck do you play that? And the answer is, I don't know. Um, I, I don't want to fuck with a truss rod at all. Right in here. But I think that's what happened. I think, cause I kept going up and down in elevation. And um, uh, the last tour I went on was 2016. And um, I remember somebody saying they wanted to, um, oh, let me intonate your guitar because you've been going up and down in elevation a bunch. And this is what I'm stuck with. But it's really hard to play open stuff. 
if I'm using a capo, like how I normally play it with it down here, like it's, it's fine. Like you can see, like it's like a normal guitar. But um, when I play open, especially coming down here, and you're gonna hear it on a couple songs, it's really hard. And um, because I don't play all the time, it um, hurts my little baby fingers. Um, but then I didn't know if it was my saddle. I don't know if you could see my saddle on the bridge right there. I'm thinking maybe I should like try to hammer that down. But I think I might need to just bring my neck back down after that dude um, kind of fucked it up a little bit. Oh, dude, I gotta fucking take care of this beast. But like I need to do shit. I need to fucking get this, my input jack taken care of. I mean, I'm playing on fucking Saturday at the fucking scare fair thing. So I need to fucking either do something. And then that was the other thing. These strings have been on this guitar since 2016. And you should always put new strings on before you record and all this other shit. But I don't want to fucking change anything. I don't even want to change my horrible intonation <clears throat> until this album's over. And probably until this show's over. And then I want to like kind of have a new clean slate. But um, because this album is so fucking dirty and so like raw, I wanted to leave all of the things on here that are raw and dirty because like every time I play like my fingers get filthy because there's so much dirt in these strings and I'll show you guys as we go but um yeah so anyway you guys are like what the fuck is happening right now <laughs> okay so this is Langser and this uh, this one I haven't played for you guys or yet um, or anybody for that matter since 2003 but it's um, about, um, I got this book on vampire lore from around the world. And there's a vampire called Langsir from either Malaysia or Singapore. I think it's Malaysia. And um, <clears throat> it eats babies or something. And the only way you can cure it. It has a mouth on the back of its neck and you have to put fingernail clippings and hair into its mouth. And um, I believe it's the only, I, I could be totally fucking wrong about this, but I believe it's the only mythology, like vampire lore, that the... Vampire can come back and be a normal person again. Like if you fill their neck up with nails and hair. Um, yeah, I probably just blew all your minds. So look it up. Google it. I'm sure that's a fucking thing. Okay. Now this I have to get a little bit closer to because the there's a lot more words in this one. And this is one that's going to hurt my hand playing guaranteed so let's cross our fingers here guys in fact let me see if i can all right this is gonna be sloppy um for some fucking reason
they were different in life, so was red and gray. Thought in black and white, so much to say. Tell me, Stan, I knew why you born a game, Joe. Your pants with the beat is in the end. You've been before, but now's your chance. Now's your chance. There is a very, very good possibility that that song is trash. Not the song, but the recording of it. I don't want to make excuses, but there's just something that I can't do the way I used to do. And I've been trying to figure it out, and I just can't fucking do it. I don't know what the fuck's going on. So, that might be one either ditched, or I probably won't ditch it. I don't give a fuck, usually. Okay. Oh, rats and apple pie. How does this one go again? Smokes and shadow take a brain So snow and design all your pounds of pain Anxiety rushes happiness and bliss See it's out that how blows you and case Planes in the living room, dishes in the sky, boats in my teeth, and bats and apple pie. Planes in the living room, dishes in the sky, boats in my teeth, ain't right. Bye. 
rats and apple pie. It makes me wonder, murder is a crown. Ain't if I even have the time. Water's running full, floor is feeling now. An angel in a queue, full of blood clouds. Planes in the living room, dishes in the sky. Bullets in my teeth, rats in apple pie. Planes in the living room, dishes in the sky, boots in my teeth, ain't rats, rats in that boom pie. Rats in that boom pie. Rats and apple pie Rats and apple pie <sighs> That came out okay. Yeah. So it was okay. And then the other man, I need to completely retune, so I won't do that one yet. So we'll come back to that. And Bloodless Rage. I don't think I played this one for you guys either. Hey, you know what's cool? When you, like, take your capo and just, like, fucking throw it across the room because your depth perception is still fucked because you just woke up. And you should never record when you first wake up. But for some reason, I always fucking do it. Like, I should let hours go by and let my voice, like, marinate in being alive. But I never do it. And you shouldn't drink coffee. You should drink warm shit, but not coffee, because the caffeine constricts your vocal cords. But it's like, hey, does anyone have broken glass I could fucking gargle on right now? God, I'm such a fucking, like, oh, I'll rebel against anything. It's like, oh, you have a fucking rule? Oh, tell me what it is so I can fucking do the opposite. I'm such a fucking douchebag. All right. Well, enough about that, right? Okay, so how does this one start? Oh, yeah, so I'll just go. Yeah, I like that. Hey, 
Cain and James He been put in his congregate In my veins is blue loose favorite song at all <clears throat> but it was written with all these other ones so Whew. and again a lot of these songs probably aren't like acoustic type songs but I try to make them so that song is just hard to fucking play on this okay so anyway I just sang a song called Bloodlust Rage, and then I got an owie. So, um, I'm amazing, obviously. All right. So, this one you guys have heard. This is a friend of mine. So... Yeah, that ending's tricky for me. So, we'll see how that goes. Now, you might be thinking to yourself, why... No, I'm not going to jinx myself. I'll wait till this is over, and then we'll have that conversation. <clears throat> if you're a friend of us, you're not a friend of mine. I can't believe I need to fucking do this after I just fucking said I wasn't going to tell that story. God damn it. These strings, I don't know what the fuck is going on. They're so high that like I get my fingers caught in them. It's fucking really weird. And then like dirty fingers. Remember I was telling you? Like, is this even showing you? Like, yeah. And then let me see. And you can see. Oh, you can't really see right there. Okay. Oh my god, unbelievable. <sighs> so the story I was going to tell you was, um, I'm like a one take guy. I hate doing more than one take. And the reason is, I think, um, the first like solo album I did, um, it's actually on like my Spotify and whatever the fuck else you listen to me on, but it's called, um, the untimely death of spade 13, that album, I think the release has eight songs on it and the actual recording had 12, I think, <clears throat> and I'll end up putting the rest of the songs out eventually, but that song, that album took a year and a half to record a year and a half of going in every weekend. So like, if you look at it like that, it's not a year and a half, but, um, <clears throat> we went into this studio called glow in the dark studios in Anaheim and was it Anaheim or orange. I can't remember, but it was just like, finessing 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 and i'm like dude i could have had this album done in like five minutes just like with all your shit just hit record and let us fucking do our thing and 
that's that. It was a good experience to see how how the other do their kind of thing. Um, <clears throat> and um, one of the funniest things about that is the producer, his name was Tad. can't remember his last name. He didn't like that I scooped my notes. And if you don't know what scooping is, it's like when I go like, rage, like I'm like moving along with it. Okay. <clears throat> and he likes you to go, rage, like just get to the notes. And so he kept trying to make me not do that. And so he would use um, auto tune. Um, like the, do you believe in like the share thing. Um, I'm sure like it has been done by other people than share and kid rock, but that is like my musical knowledge. Um, and he would auto tune my vocals and then give me the CD and say, I'll go home and sing like that. And I would go home and sing like that. And then I would go back to the studio and I'd go, because I scoop. I just fucking scoop. That's just who I am, you know? So that's that. So anyway, that's why I hate doing more than one take. It's like, I'm just, I have an aversion to it. So it's like, um, do it right the first time or be stuck with an inferior product. And that was the snapshot in time of what you did that day. Seems fucking logical to me, right? So let's try this song again. <clears throat> oh, actually, before I do it, I want to... Because I always... So, uh... So, uh... should take everything more seriously probably oh, I gotta are you serious the fridge is kicking on right now Jesus Christ see I shouldn't have ran my dick like a I wanted to play this to play the slower too so i'm gonna try to play it slower I, I started playing it too fast and then tried to slow it down last time oh my god if your friend of us you're not afraid Your friend. 
die. Whew. Well, that was good, except for that one fucking bit. And my fucking finger got stuck in these fucking strings. I don't know what the fuck is happening. Um, if anyone knows why that happens, let me know. And you guys are like, uh, yeah, it's when you don't know how to fucking play guitar, you douchebag. Um, that would be awesome. I would love to know why that's like that. So let's see. What do we have here? We've been... Oh, wow. Okay, so this is what I'm going to do. I am going to actually... Oh, my leg's asleep. I got to get my um, slide. And I got to figure out my Spanish tuning again. So, oh, whew. I'm falling all over the place, guys. I'm falling all over the place. Um, I'm going to go get my slide, and um, I'll be right back. You know what's funny, too? Like, I <clears throat> didn't tune my guitar beforehand. So I'm kind of hoping that it stayed in tune. And I'm sitting here going, oh yeah, I'm going to do this in E or maybe F sharp. And like my guitar was probably like almost in D. Um, because I'm a bad man. You're supposed to tune your fucking guitar before you record. Jesus Christ. So here's my D. And here's my E. So let's see. Okay, and then it's G. Okay, so I'll take my G. And my G is always fucking not right, so let's see. No. Alright, so. said the, the B um, is never, like it's always a little flat, so you got to sharpen it up or the other way around or something. goes because I don't know if it's even gonna I don't know like I haven't played it since that one podcast I did where I'm like hey this is kind of a song I've been fucking around with since 2001 
fuck I'm doing right now? Oh, I... Fuck. Okay. I was recording. <clears throat> All right. So let's try that again. sloppiest version of that song I've ever played, but I kind of liked it. So we're going to go with it. I think I, uh, when I got up and walked off earlier, I, uh, pulled, I didn't pull, my leg was asleep. Um, it's just really weird. I've been 
putting this album off since 2003. It took me 45 minutes to record it, 58 minutes, whatever. And it's so funny because now that it's done, well, the recording part, and I don't really do a whole lot in post, but um, all I can think of is the next album. I really want to do my four-part Goodbye Hope thing. Those are like probably the best songs I've ever written, like at least Purdy. Um, but anyway, so Skin Slip. I'm going to try to get it out this week. Um I don't know how long it'll take to get on all the platforms, but I actually need to go through because there are like something like 30 platforms that my stuff's on. And, um, I only tell people about Spotify because I don't really fucking know anything else, but like, um, I don't know. I need to update my website with all that shit. But anyway, um, I hope this was interesting or fun or whatever. Like, I don't know. Um, so hopefully this was cool. So, um, and I'll see you guys later. Okay. Drag the river, drag the smell, and the mist of the cities and the TV. Drag the river, drag the smell for me. You need sound to see you. came back on because I tried to do something different and I don't know if I like it. I think I do, but I wanted to record in that big room because of the reverb in that big room. The thing that I didn't think or I didn't expect to have, and maybe this is just me not being very intelligent when it comes to recording was how bright the sound is <clears throat> and I like the bright sound because it gives a lot of gain like natural gain to what I did but it's kind of bright and the other thing that's weird is that my vocals are a lot louder than I would have expected I thought the guitar would kind of drown me out so I was purposefully trying to sing louder than I normally would. <clears throat> and I thought um, Drag the River there would be the one to really show me what's what. But, um, I don't know. Let me listen to Mimes and Worms here and see how this goes. There's no name that gets no name. The bright on that. That gets this moment, both of us in that gas down in the street. When she smells, so it seems. When she smells, we seem to be. When she smells, out the same. Just the same with boobs, well, they need asking, and hideous maggots deep yeah. within. Wow. 
probably sounds like shit but bloodless rage because that song <clears throat> is barely a song so let's see how this sounds and I tried to only hit the top three strings I do like that the dissonance mm. yeah I always pictured this with drums but whatever It is what it is, you know? And then there was a part of me, because when I, I played back the video, and the video um, doesn't have as much bright as the recording on the phone does. And so I was wondering, like, should I, like, take those two and, like, put them together? Like, am I getting too crazy? Like, but, like, the whole skin slip, like, the whole... It's supposed to be so dirty strings, fucked up guitar, um, pitchy vocals, really bright, fucking dirty strings. I wonder. Uh, I wonder. I don't know. I don't know if I'm gonna do anything to it. I might just leave it completely as is, and um, see how it goes. And then that way, if I ever, like, get legendary or die or something, then, like, my estate could do a, a, a remastered version of this. Yeah. Yeah, I'll do it like that so my kid could, like, make a couple bucks down the road a little bit, I guess. But anyway... Um, I don't know if I'm going to have anything more for this, but yeah, that was me recording an album real quick and being unsure about it because that's kind of how it always rolls. So, um, yeah, I hope you enjoy it. I really hope you enjoy it. <laughs> 